If you want to stay up to date with all current hip hop events and releases, make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications to become part of this community. So Pop Smoke is dropping his new album this week, this Friday, July 16th. So I thought it was only right to make this video to kind of build some hype up for it. Also because we just got an official announcement that puts this whole thing in a whole different light from Steven Victor. Um, because he announced we're going to get straight into it because that's what y'all are here for, right? Right? So he took to Twitter to say that this new album, which we thought was going to be self-titled because that's what it you know, was uh, promoted as and the trailer kind of stated it as that as a self-titled record. But we got word from Steven Victor himself saying that this new record is going to be called Faith. And this is official. It was immediately picked up by a lot of outlets. Rap TV was one of the first ones to report on this. So we actually have a name for this new Pop Smoke record record. Now, one thing that also had a lot of people concerned is that there is a page on Apple Music which kind of lists the track list for the record so far. It has the self-titled um, you know, title of it, which had a lot of people worried. Also, the album cover had a lot of people worried because the album cover was just that logo of, you know, pop smoke which doesn't look really cool but from that we can see that the that the album had 17 tracks um and we you know we saw that there was an outro track as a 17th track that was the only thing that was clear and now there's been several other leaks going around also from apple music track lists that actually list like real track lists also 17 tracks so this seems pretty real also the features on here are feature that features that we've you know heard of being in the works heard of happening in the past as well uh, so i think this might be very close to what the final thing is going to look like so let's talk about it so track number one eternal we can't say anything about that but the ones with the features are actually the ones interesting like track two slow down featuring drake of course, Drake was always kind of rumored as a feature on Pop Smoke's new album, but we never actually got the confirmation. There are leaks going around. We talked about this on the Discord yesterday, uh, going over you know different leaks and what features are going to be on the record, and this seems to be now the case. Then we have Paid in Full, then Flooded featuring Travis Scott and Don Tolliver, which is a combo, a duo that I love to see being featured on a record just because... You know, I talked about Don Tolliver being that very niche Travis Scott. So if Travis is also, you know, tapping into that lane of his style with, you know, Don Tolliver by his side, this track could be, that could be amazing. Then we have True Story. Then we have Ain't Nothing featuring Nicki Minaj and Lil Wayne. Of course, that duo is um, an all-time favorite. I love that he has all three of the, the Young Money crew on here, you know, Drake, uh, Nicki, and Wayne, which, uh, you know, we recently saw reunite on Seeing Green, which was an amazing track, so I love that he uh, has these on here. Of course, not he himself has them on here, but the people who later put together the album, something I talked about a lot in the past too, but of course, some of these could have been envisioned by him could have been recorded by him before his passing so i'll give it the benefit of the doubt track number seven guns and roses featuring bobby Schmurda. this was definitely put together after his death because bobby Schmurda hadn't been out when he died uh so i'm excited for that because we didn't hear a lot from bobby ever since he got released so uh, that'll be interesting track number eight is grip featuring 21 savage and Moneybag yo I can see, kind of imagine what this track is going to be like, uh, so this is kind of nothing crazy. Then Face to Face, then Picture This featuring Durkio and Uzi. Probably can also kind of imagine what this is going to sound like. Same goes for Watching featuring NBA Youngboy. Then we have Neat Nobody. And then Touch featuring Dua Lipa, who's recently also took to Twitter to say, uh, you cannot say pop and forget the smoke, which was really weird to see from her account. But uh, they've had a collaboration in the works ever since before Pop had passed. So this is actually a track that they did together, um, which she confirmed and a lot of, you know, outlets reported on this. So this is actually happening, that Dua Lipa track. We knew about this ever since, even before this leaked track list. So that is another reason why I think this track list could be real, could be very close to the final thing. Um, so 
that's that. Then we have Mr. Jones, Stars in the Sky, Real Thing, featuring Chris Brown, which is going to be interesting, but I can kind of, you know, already hear what this is going to sound like. Chris Brown is not really a feature anyone's excited about in 2021. And then we have that outro track kind of uh, connecting it to that other track list that you can see on Apple Music. So I think this is very close to being real, judging from just the features that we have confirmed so far, judging from the amount of tracks, which is 17, and the fact that there's an outro track, which is titled Outro and is also titled Outro in the Apple Music track list uh, so far. So this is probably real. Um, of course, this is not 100%. Uh, confirmed, but we're probably going to get a track list sometime this week, probably on Wednesday or Thursday, when we also get the album cover, because we don't have the official album cover yet, I don't think it's going to be that Pop Smoke logo, that would just be way too cheap, we already saw that whole, you know, debacle going down last year with a shoot for the stars and for the moon, where Virgil did a design for the Pop Smoke uh, album cover, and it was just horrible, people completely you know, he got some really serious backlash, and then they just did that Chrome Rose, um, which this new cover is in the same style, but I hope that there is still something coming that is going to replace just this basic logo uh, in the future, or at least sometime this week. This week is going to be interesting. We're going to see a lot of things unfold in this whole uh, Pop Smoke Faith um, album rollout. We're going to probably get an, like a, another announcement with the real title. We're going to get the official release day, which is this Friday, but as like a post on social media, we're going to get the track list, the album cover, but this is what we have so far. As I said, not 100% official, but this is probably very close to what it's going to end up being like, so uh, you can cling to that, you kind of stick to that. I hope this gave some of you more insight into what's to come from this album than you had before, because so far we've really been left in the dark with it, ever since we got that trailer, of course, which just featured some old moments from him but um yeah this is looking pretty solid it's nothing that i didn't expect it's uh to be expected the features that we have on here the tracks that we have on here the length of the record i still think it's shorter than shoot for the stars and for the moon if i remember correctly so um yeah i'm looking forward to this i'm hoping this will be like a, a last moment for him to shine to to express his legacy and for him to leave something behind for people to remember but that's my thoughts on this now i want to know what you think about this are you excited for faith which is now the confirmed name by pop smoke dropping this friday july 16th what do you think the track list is going to be like do you think this is the final version what features are you excited for what tracks specifically all of that let me know in the comments down below if you watched this video to the end and liked it, and you want to stay up to date with all current hip-hop events and releases, make sure to subscribe, turn on notifications, hit that like button, and go follow my social media and blog down in the description. It really helps me out. Until the next one, y'all have an incredible day, and y'all take care.